So I've been asked often um, how the strings on my fiddle work, which I use to hold it onto my shoulder so I can play in an unrestricted way. Um, so I'm going to make a little video so that I don't have to keep answering the question over and over. So I have two strings. One of them goes around my neck. One of them goes around my arm up here. Uh, I'm going to take it off. I have to take this one off first. No, I don't. I've got that wrong. Sorry. When I think about it, I do this without thinking. It's fine. So you have to take this one off first. And then you take this one off. Yes. Okay. So I have two strings. This one's actually elastic. It's kind of like, what would you call that? Is that an inch? Inch thick knicker elastic. Um, from a sewing shop. And this is just like nylon cord or something like that. I don't know, I can't remember where I got it from. Um, so, this one I have fairly central on my fiddle. I have a chin rest, which I don't obviously use as a chin rest, but I have it on there. It's a nice little tiny one. And I have it there purely so I can tie around here. And that's where I've tied, well, no, this string is tied half through there and half through my tailpiece wire to get it kind of as central as I can-ish. That's the one that goes over my head. The other one, I tie around these two. And that's gonna go over my left arm. So when I first tried it, <clears throat> I just had the this. Well, actually, the first time I tried it, I had Velcro with a big popper. And I stick a Velcro badge with a big popper and I stuck it on like that. But I found that just pulled on whatever clothing I had. There was none of my clothing was tight enough for it to really work. So I gave that idea up. So then I tried with just this. But what then happens is there's not, even with this shoulder rest, there just doesn't seem to be enough stability somehow. Um, sideways, like when I'm pushing here, it's going like this. So that's wh why this one came into play, just to stop the fiddle doing this. That's all this one's doing. So I'm gonna go back again, because you have to put that one on first. So this one, I have, fairly high up my arm there and it's not really tight it just keeps the fiddle at that like what position do you want find the position you want it and make it that long then it stops there look and then this one now the nut sticks in my forehead a bit when I do this because I want it as tight as I can get it because obviously once you've got it over your head this part of your body isn't as tight, as, isn't big as this bit. Mine isn't anyway. Um, but you want this as close as possible. So it's obviously going to be tight when it pulls over your head. It stretches in time and then you have to like add another knot in or something or just replace it. Same with this one. You might have noticed I've got little knots here. That's just purely because I made it a little bit too long. So then I tied a little knot to shorten it. There, that's, I would rather just not have that knot. It was just a string, but that's the way it's ended up. So there we are. So this one keeps it from going backwards and forwards. And this one stops it. Rock well, actually doesn't seem to do anything anymore, does it? Maybe I'll get rid of this one. Maybe I don't need this. What happens when I take this one off? I'm interested now. Sorry, I wasn't thinking about it. I'm just, I, I take for granted that I use that one and it does something. Now I'm wondering if it does with the chin with the shoulder rest in place. Maybe I cooked up that string before I used the shoulder rest. What happens now? No, that's right. Look, it, it it's not quite as stable. Um, I think the string works good. I don't know what it, it's very subtle what that string does, but it definitely helps. Uh, you can still spin it the fiddle a little bit if you want to, which I would probably do when I went down to the lower strings if I was going down there for any length of time. 
So that's it. Just a little recap. This one goes between the nut, the, the, the tailpiece nut, and the near side post of the chin rest. And this other string goes around both sides of the chin rest. Good luck if you fancy a go at that.